Okay, this is going to be part four of the video training series for the sprayer. And so now we're going to look at how the boom sprayer and the hand wand works. So as you can hear, I've got the Honda running, so we have a power source. I'm going to go ahead and switch the power to on, and we're going to go look at this back boom. So you hear the motor running, and you see the boom is spraying, and you can clearly see your mark on the gravel. So that's how you'll track. You can see it's a good wide span, so it shouldn't take you very long to cover a lot of territory. And what I did is I actually turned that red valve on before I turned the switch on in the cab. So let's reverse that order so we don't get chemical on us. Now I'm going to flick the switch off. Okay. And you see that the sprayer also stops, maybe a little trickle. But what we would do is we would come up here and we'd shut this valve off. So that's the trick. You never want to mess with that valve unless your switch up there in the cab is turned off so that you don't have any power and that way you don't have to worry about any chemical getting on you. And uh, we'll also go ahead and look at the hand sprayer while we've got it working. So uh, I'm going to turn the switch back on. Now as you can see, uh, not really anything going on with the boom because I've got my valve turned off. So now we're going to do the hand sprayer. And let's see how that works. Got some grass down here we can spray. And you see good distance there on the spray wand. In fact, very good distance there. Okay. All right. If you have any questions, give me a call.